how to back up your iPhone to your external hard drive. As the title of this video says, in this tutorial, I will show you how to back up your iPhone on an external hard drive to save space on your MacBook. By default, you are not able to choose where to save your backup. It'll be saved automatically on your local drive. Usually iOS backups are quite big. Mine, for example, is around 3.8 GB, and I don't want to waste my SSD space on my Mac just to store my iPhone backups. It's way more practical to keep your iOS backups on an external hard drive so you can access them only when there is such a need. As often we don't have enough free storage on our MacBooks to keep iPhone backups. My method is very simple and does not require any special knowledge or any third-party applications. We will create a link between the backup folder on your Mac at your external hard drive where the actual data will be stored. To perform backup on an external hard drive, just follow three simple steps. Step number one. Plug your external hard drive into your MacBook and create a folder named Backup on your external drive. It's important to name the folder Backup with the capital B. You can place this backup folder in any other folder of your choice. In my case, iPhone XMax Backups. Step number two. Open Finder. Go to Folder Library. Library stores all the most important system files of your Mac. In Library, search for Application Support, open it and search for the mobile sync folder in this place. Mac OS saves all backups of your iPhone or iPad. Copy your existing backups into the backup folder you just created on your external hard drive, and delete the backup folder in mobile sync on your Mac. If you don't have any backups, just simply delete the backup folder in mobile sync on your Mac. Step number three. Now, we'll be linking your backup folder on your external hard drive to the mobile sync folder on your Mac so your backup will be saved on your external hard drive and not on your computer, but your MacBook will be thinking that the backup is still stored in the mobile sync folder locally on your computer. Basically, we'll be creating a link between a folder stored on your Mac and a folder on an external drive. I hope you got the idea. Open Terminal app on your Mac and type the following command. Then drag the backup folder that you just created on your external hard drive to the terminal, and it'll automatically create a path for it. Next, go back to the application support and drag the whole mobile sync folder into terminal and press enter. As you can see, we just created a link between these two folders. You can confirm that by going to the mobile sync folder on your Mac and you will see a backup folder with a little arrow. By clicking on it, it'll automatically redirect you to your external hard drive where actually your backup data is stored. Now you can do the backup of your iOS device, and it will be automatically stored on your external hard drive without taking space on your Mac. I will leave this terminal comment.